LG Display is exploring a way to further boost OLED TV brightness by 20%. Hi friends and welcome to Victor's Reality. Today we have some news from Flat Panels HD by way of the ELEC that LG Display may apply micro lenses to OLED TV panels to further boost brightness by 20% to around 1200 nits. Production may start as early as of this year, according to the report. By applying micro lenses to the existing OLED TV panels, the light path can be optimized for efficiency, meaning that the brightness is increased while overall power consumption is reduced. LG Display is known to expect a 20% improvement in OLED luminance by applying the micro lens, under a premise that the product lifespan is the same. If the OLED luminance increases, power consumption can be saved at the same luminance, said the report. This could increase peak brightness to 1200 nits. However, it would still be lower than Samsung Display's QD OLED TV panel, which maxes out at 1500 nits. That shows the power of QD OLED with the current OLED technology as of right now. Samsung with its QD OLED has a major advantage for the foreseeable future. The maximum luminance of LG Display existing large OLED was 800 nits. The maximum luminance of OLED EX is estimated to be at 1000 nits, which is 30% higher than this. By adding a micro lens, the maximum luminance can be raised to 1200 nits. The report cautions that LG Display is still reviewing the technology. If it decides to press forward, the micro lenses are likely to be applied as early as this year to mass production units at one of LG Display's two current OLED TV factories in Korea and China. If mass production starts in late 2022, the new technology may be introduced in LG's 2023 OLED TV lineup. And that was a report by Flat Panels HD. Now reading the Alex reporting, Basically, everything we just heard with flat panels is the same, except some cool information I found right here. And this is by the way of the elect. Micro lenses are not new to the panel industry. Micro lenses were applied not only to the optical sheet of LCD panels that use light emitting diodes, LEDs, as a light source, but also OLED panels from Samsung Electronics Galaxy S21 Ultra. Even with the same OLED, it's expected that the micro lens application method of smartphones and TVs will be different. The OLED of Samsung Electronics Galaxy S21 Ultra has a front light emitting structure in which light exits in the opposite direction to the substrate. So the micro lens process is performed after the encapsulation process. It is likely that some processes will be added to the process. So that's really interesting to see that the Galaxy S21 Ultra has some kind of technology with with micro lenses. As we all know, Galaxy phones, their screens look amazing, but it's awesome to see LG now exploring to make OLED or their existing OLED panels brighter than ever. As technology advances, more competition is always good to earn our hard-earned dollars. And QD OLED technology is hitting the market by storm. Please don't forget to check out the playlist here on the channel to help you make that awesome buying decision. QD OLED is the future. More competition is good, and I can't wait to see what LG comes up with to give Samsung a run for its money. So friends, if you liked the video, please hit that like button as it helps the channel tremendously and consider subscribing if you do want to see more breaking news information on OLED or QD OLED technology. The future looks bright for us display enthusiasts. Stay safe out there and I'll see you guys next time.